My name is uh, Navza Engineer. I graduated from UT Dallas uh, 2004 with a PhD in neuroscience. And currently I'm the chief science officer at Microtransponder, which is a medical device company that was spun out of UT Dallas. At that time, uh, you know, the 80s and the 90s, there wasn't much going on in neurology. There wasn't anything new. And so I've always wanted to know, you know, do we want to keep doing the same thing or can we try to understand how the brain works and develop new technologies or new therapies? So that's where it led me from going from neurology to research uh, and now back to neurology in a way. So when I uh, came to UT Dallas, I started out in the lab of Dr. Michael Kilgard, who was studying how the brain processes sounds. And so at that time, we were interested in uh, deep brain stimulation and from deep brain stimulation of what we were doing earlier led to this non -in less invasive technique called vagus nerve stimulation. We spent nights in the lab drinking Dr. Pepper, a lot, a lot of Dr. Pepper. In fact, he introduced me to Dr. Pepper and I would drink like six or seven Dr. Peppers because you had to stay awake to keep the rat under anesthesia. He was an amazing teacher as well as an amazing uh, mentor. And I do owe him a lot for just cultivating uh, to you know where I am today for sure. I think it's important a place like UTD where you can develop relationships with not only your colleagues within other departments, but with industry, uh, paths to commercialization and industry and networking. Because in the end, yes, you do something in the lab, but then what's it good for, right? It has to be good for something. And so UTD gives you that advantage to, I mean, now we have the commercialization and technology office. I mean, this is a great place to be, I think, for both uh, industry as well as to help students and get their products out into, into the real world. I think my greatest accomplishment is getting something out from the lab into the clinic, into the real world to help real patients. And so that journey, uh, I think, was challenging, but in the end, it was worth it because uh, we are now implanting real patients, stroke patients, with that same device that started out at UTD and RATS is now uh, in our patients in the real world. I'm pretty proud of this award. Uh, you know, it's something that uh, I maybe wasn't expecting, but what could be better than helping somebody, you know, with a stroke or some neurological condition. So I would say, yes, I'm, I'm excited about the award, but also excited about the future and keep continuing to help uh, patients.